everybody. Desi and Reese decided to come to the shop, ride with me. Getting out for a little bit. Why it's still a little nice. Your camera on. Huh? I said I need your camera. Back to the shop. They ended up giving me a vest because it's starting to get nice and warm. So, uh, Reese had to leave on the middle of the ride here. Desi's heading to the house. He's got some work to do. So, my guys. So. I came all the way out to the shop just to come ride with me here, so, hell uh, yeah. Glad to see the uh, ZX-10R, man. I haven't seen it until now. Nice. Not gonna lie, it's nice. video by the time I get to the shop <laughs> and start editing that was that's crazy crazy Bill Willie in front of us the SM ow the SPD as they call themselves they ain't call themselves the STD. <laughs> ah, just playing them. Them guys and girls, man, they put in a lot of work. You know, they're just doing their job to help keep everybody protected and safe. And you know what? I salute my hand to every single one of y'all. And I appreciate everything y'all do. That goes for any service member everywhere. I don't care who you are. If you're wearing a badge or you're doing anything at all within the military, EMS, fire, police, I don't care what it is. You know, I, I appreciate everything you do. Don't don't think just because us bikers, we get out here, act a goon. We act a goon. It's what we do. But there's no reason to harass us. Because, oh, we're riding on the back wheel. Okay, yeah, it's illegal. Trust me, I know. But we do it for the fun and pleasure. And the people that actually know what the hell they're doing, yeah, I'm new to the wheelie scene as far as getting it back on it and riding it out and all that stuff. At least I know, and a lot of my guys know, 
that I know that are actually professional. There's there's stunt people that are paid to do this stuff, regardless if it's in a street or an arena. They know whether to look back, make sure no one's behind them, and no one's right next to them when they go to do that. So if we're out in open traffic, leave us be. Let us do our thing. We're not going to hurt nobody. It, it's not going to be a, a problem or a cause or anything. You know, if we go down and no one's around us and our bikes, like if, like I had my guys behind me on this ride, and I did a wheelie, they backed off so the cars that was behind them would back off in case I went down. They know what to do. And if you're riding with a group of people like that, that knows what to do, okay, they see that you're about to go up. Yeah, you can give them some type of warning, whatever. My guys know when I go to do something stupid, they know I'll give them some type of signal. And I just don't flop it out, you know. Well, I did on, on the ride down here. I wasn't intending to do a wheelie, but my bike went up, I rode it out. I, I just took it to the whatever, you know. I was actually just trying to get down and go because I haven't had this bike get down and go in forever. And no, we just like to have fun. We, we don't want to be harassed for what we love, what we like doing. And we get harassed a lot. So, it is what it is. Got a big ride in literally two months. I gotta get my shit together. Hey, I like how Reese was like, I think I know you. And then he seen my jacket. He's like, dude, I watch your YouTube channel. <laughs> hey, shout out Reese. Love you, brother. <laughs> that was actually my first time ever riding with Reese. And I've heard I've heard multiple stories about him, but I've never actually rode with him until now. But uh He seemed like a really cool cat. So can't wait for further rides, man. Further rides.